morning you guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is caitlin today's video is so fun if it's your first time clicking on my channel then this was definitely a good video to start off on if you're a foodie like me then you probably grocery shop a bunch and right now i have almost zero groceries in my fridge i just got back from a trip and i traveled like all the month of june so i'm in need of an entire restock and refresh so i thought it would be so fun to take you guys with me to the grocery store and show you guys exactly how I grocery shop, how I plan out my grocery list, and also just do a huge grocery haul of all of my favorite Trader Joe's items and also whole food items. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and let's get into it. So what I'm having this week, kind of my recipe menu is for breakfast, I have the option between English muffin sandwiches with egg and avocado, smoothies with like a chocolate protein, and then a green smoothie. So those are my three breakfast options that I'm gonna grocery shop for today. For lunches, I'm gonna recreate the earth salad that I've been obsessed with lately. I have a recipe on my Instagram. I will link it down below and put it right here. And then also vegan burrito bowls and then just leftovers. I always make enough dinner to have leftovers, especially because I live with my boyfriend. So we love to have just like easy leftovers on hand. And then I'm so excited for dinners this week. We are gonna do a spaghetti bolognese with a homemade sauce. Sauce. We're also doing chicken tacos this week and then also salmon plates. Not sure how long these groceries are gonna last in my fridge. It's always a little bit different depending on how many times we eat out. So I'm actually gonna go work out as well before I go to the grocery store. I kind of always do that just because I'm already leaving the apartment. So why leave, come back, and then go? You guys can see my Whole Foods bag back there. Something that I always do since I usually do go to two grocery stores, always bring a freezer bag. I get these at Trader Joe's and they're actually insulated. So that way in Arizona, my food isn't like going bad. So I always, always, always bring a grocery bag. That is such a big tip if you go to two grocery stores. I also ended up grabbing a smoothie. I went and worked out this morning and then I went straight to Whole Foods and I always have to eat after my workouts. I was like honestly feeling sick because I hadn't eaten. So I just got a smoothie. My go-to smoothie order lately at Whole Foods is their pea protein, the chocolate one. Almond milk, banana, peanut butter, and then spinach as well. So good. It's obviously almost gone because I was drinking it the entire time while I was grocery shopping. So it just made the entire grocery shop even more fun. Love that. We are going to go to Trader Joe's now and I'll show you guys a huge grocery haul when I get home. Okay, I'm gonna run through the groceries very quickly. So let's start off with produce from Trader Joe's. Starting off, I got avocados. I always get avocados for avocado toast, for tacos, burrito bowls, all the things. Probably my favorite food ever. So I got a bunch of avocado, a large bag of cilantro. The Trader Joe's that I go to has fresh cilantro grown from a farm that's like local. Love that, so I got a bunch of cilantro. I also got some fresh basil. As you guys can probably tell, I love cooking with herbs. I feel like it just makes a dish taste so much better and more fresh, and I just love them. So I got some cilantro and also some basil today. Sometimes I get parsley, but there actually wasn't any left today. Onions for the tacos and also the spaghetti recipe. Bell peppers. Not only do I love bell peppers for snacking, but I also love to add them in so many different recipes. I always do like fajita veggies with my tacos, or I probably will add some into the tomato paste tonight for the spaghetti. So I got the tricolor peppers. I can't go a day without having lime, so I got a bunch of limes. I do lime on avocado toast in my tacos, burrito bowls, honestly everything. Same goes for lemons. I always have warm lemon water either in the morning or at night. I find it super refreshing and I just love it so I got a bunch of lemons some Roma tomatoes I'm gonna put this in my Greek salad that I have planned for the week a large English cucumber if you guys watch my channel you know my obsession with English cucumbers they're so crisp and such a great snack I also put them in my green smoothies so good okay I also got some spinach spinach is probably my number one purchased item from the grocery store I'm always running out of spinach I put it in my smoothies almost every single day actually every single day so obviously I eat this a bunch so I had to pick some spinach up. I just get the baby spinach. Yeah, baby spinach. Also decided to grab some romaine hearts. I've been loving chopping up romaine hearts and having them in my salads, in my tacos. I just really like the crunch of romaine. I don't really like spring mix that much. 
So I got this instead for my Greek salad. Next from Trader Joe's, I'm gonna go into just like the fridge items. I don't know what else to call them. Starting off, I got the hot pico de gallo. I actually tried this in the car. It was amazing. I just really like pico de gallo. I find that it's super fresh and it's like my favorite salsa. So I got some of that. And then I also got a bunch of my favorite shots. I got a few more in the bag, but I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to read that, but I get the turmeric and also the ginger shots. I love these. These are by far my favorite Trader Joe's item because they're such a good price. Usually health shots like this at like Sprouts or Whole Foods are like literally $4 for one little shot. And I think that these are around two or $3. I just really, really love them. I got some Italian tomato paste. I put this in a few different recipes spaghetti which i'm going to be using it for this week and then also my chili so it's always nice to have in the fridge and this one you can put the cap on and keep it in the fridge so i love this this is a staple in my apartment it's the organic brown rice microwavable packet it takes three minutes to make honestly i can't find the time to make brown rice on the stove or any type of rice i feel like it takes way too long which i do do it sometimes especially if i have like a hello fresh meal or something but i just love these packets they're so easy for lunchtime hunter loves them and they honestly tastes so good moving on to the meat selection i'm having three different types of meat this week i'm having ground chicken ground turkey and then also some fish i'm having salmon i actually don't buy my salmon until the day that i'm gonna make it i always just go to sprouts or whole foods and pick up the salmon in their deli i just prefer it that way it tastes so much better when it's fresh from trader joe's i picked up turkey breast and also chicken breast i'm using the ground chicken for my tacos and i'm using the ground turkey breast for my spaghetti tonight so very excited i always get the like leanest meat i don't really have like a taste preference why not so i have those two and i think that that wraps up the trader joe's items i did get taco seasoning yeah taco seasoning for the tacos tomorrow night let's move on to my whole foods favorites i'm going to start with my garbanzo beans these garbanzo beans are just like no salt added and they're the trader joe's or sorry Whole Foods brand, so 365. I love the Whole Foods brand. If I see that there's an item that I usually get, but it's also made with the 365 brand, I usually end up going with that brand because I think it's a little bit more affordable. And two, I think that they value their ingredients a lot. So I love that about them. So pick, oh, caught it. Picked up some garbanzo beans for the Greek salad this week. I also had to get some pasta for our spaghetti. I ended up going with the Joveal. I don't know how to say that name, but I went with the 100% organic brown rice pasta. I love this pasta brand. Sometimes I do like a chickpea noodle, like bonza. So yummy, but this is the one we went with today. This is a frozen item. I'm obsessed with these. They're English muffins from the brand Food for Life. Food for Life is one of my favorite brands at the grocery store. They have such good ingredients and I love them. So I'm gonna do English muffin sandwiches this week with like avocado, egg, that type of thing. Also went with my almond milk this is the milk organic almond milk unsweetened i know a lot of people eat or drink this but it's honestly the best almond milk in my opinion it tastes so good so fresh the ingredients are just water almonds and salt this is by far my favorite almond milk it's a little bit pricey but to me it's worth it because it does taste so much better next up i got the best hummus this is the what's the brand revolutionary earthy majestic sprouted hummus ingredients are amazing the taste is there it's so good i'm gonna be snacking on this all week with cucumber carrots i'll show you guys the carrot chips that i actually got to go in it these are only sold at whole foods from what i found they remind me of like the ruffled chips obviously they taste totally different but i just mean the shape of them perfect for dipping in hummus i always get these ones from whole foods it's the 365 brand such a good match also if you're new to my channel you might not have seen these but if you're not new then you definitely see these in every single video of mine they are the nut pod they're almond and coconut creamers that's what i got in my smoothie today too a mix of almond and coconut it tastes so good to me it's like the perfect balance of coconut and nutty i got these two flavors the cinnamon swirl and also the hazelnut so good they aren't too sweet so definitely try these out if you're looking for just like a creamy creamer but you can always add like syrup or something to it I also picked up some topo chicos i really just drink water throughout the day so i've been loving adding mineral water to just like a glass it's carbonated which i actually don't love i'm not huge on carbonation that's why i don't drink soda but for some reason these don't bug me and i really like them 
and they have flavored ones but i went ahead and just got the plain i picked up some siggies this is my favorite greek yogurt brand simple ingredients plain flavor i put these in my green smoothies i just got some chocolate protein for the mornings that i don't want to have the chocolate protein or like a chocolate smoothie i'll either do greek yogurt or vanilla protein powder in my smoothies i'm just someone that likes to have protein in my smoothies so that's why i got these and then lastly i picked up some protein powder this is the orgain 21 grams of plant-based protein and creamy chocolate chocolate fudge i'm here to end off today's video it was so fun to film i did have a few groceries in the fridge already just like eggs and frozen fruit those are the two groceries i would have purchased today but i already had but you guys today's video was so fun for me to film i love grocery shopping i love healthy recipes food you guys know this about me if you guys are also into recipes grocery shopping that type of thing then definitely follow me on instagram i have a foodie instagram also, I have a personal Instagram and a TikTok. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and I will see you guys in the next one.